be the magic. They have implored a step-by-step -step method to achieve their team goals. Seven of the ten already checked off. Now let's go to New Orleans and check in with Pam Oliver. Thanks, Stephanie. And here in New Orleans, it's all about Chris Paul, the Hornets' sensational point guard who overcame a case of first-half jitters to lead the team to an impressive win and left the Mavericks scrambling for a solution, a solution New Orleans hopes they don't find. I expect them to throw the kitchen sink at us, to be honest with you. I, I think they've tried to do a lot of things as far as trapping Chris, trying to get it out of his hands. Uh, I think we're going to see that again, uh, even probably some full-court press try to get out of his hands. Uh, it's going to be interesting to see because we've pretty much seen everything. Uh, I'd be crazy if I was to say I haven't heard, you know, what, what people have said or the newspaper clippings. And uh, I think they said they want me to play a little bit more defense and, and things like that. But uh, we, we're just going to stick to our game plan and see if it works. Now for more on the Spurs and Suns, let's go to David Aldridge in San Antonio. Pam, thanks very much. Even though the Spurs have had the Suns number,